visit the library anymore because these days I'm checking out books from my couch. Many libraries across the US now let you check out ebooks and read them on an e reader like a Kindle or your phone or tablet. The best part is that it's free and it's really easy to do. So, the first thing you want to do is download and install Overdrive Media Console. This is the portal that most branches use for ebook checkouts. Create an account and sign in. Then open the left sidebar and hit Add a Library. Then search for your library. In this case, it's the San Jose Public Library. Once it shows up, tap it, star it, and tap the name of the library to launch the website. At this point, sign into your library account by clicking this link up here. You'll need your library card number and a PIN. If you don't have a PIN, you can just visit your library's website to create one. Once you're signed in, you're ready to start checking out ebooks. Now, don't be shocked when the selection isn't as great as the actual library because not all books are available as ebooks and not all libraries are willing to buy ebook licenses for every book. Also know that just like there's a limit to the number of copies libraries carry for any given book, there's also a limited number of ebook licenses. So in some cases, you might have to put yourself on the waiting list. Once you find a book you want, hit borrow and select the delivery method. If you have a Kindle or Kindle app on your device, you can use that version. Otherwise, download the EPUB or use this option to read it in the browser. Personally, I prefer the Kindle app. From there, you'll be taken to the Amazon website where you'll choose the device where the book will get delivered. And if you did everything correctly, that book should show up in your Kindle library. If you have any questions or tips of your own, hit me up on Twitter and check out CNET.com slash how to for more tips like this. For CNET, I'm Sharon Profis.